Hello fellow gamers and I'm playing Just Cause 3 and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to get this Squalo X7 powerboat back to your garage. Uh, it's quite it's actually quite a fun way to do it this way. You don't need a helicopter. You don't need one of them big dumper truck things. All you need is your grappling hook and that is it. You need to come to this um, lake on the right hand side of the map. Put a waypoint down where you need to go which is to the coast. So anywhere on the sort of right hand side would do. Then get in the boat, drive it towards that waypoint. Doesn't have to be spot on, but as close to it as you sort of can. Obviously not right, you know, forward there because there's that there's that big mountain in the way. Which we are going to have to go around. Use your grappling hook. Grapple it to the boat. Yeah, don't shoot your gun. <laughs> and then to the ground and then reel it in. I think it's R R2 to reel it in. And all you have to do is keep doing this. and get a bit closer to the coast. This boat is pretty robust really. More more than you actually realise. Now we've got a car in the way. Oh I actually got in this car and I thought I wonder if I could actually tow the boat because that would probably be a bit quicker so I thought right get a biggish car try towing it but we've got oh I was gonna say we have to get rid of that one but it he moved out of the way by his, his, um, himself I thought it would be worth trying just to see but uh, obviously the car is not powerful enough. But you've got to try these things, you've got to try and find what works and what doesn't work. Move the car out of the way so I can actually move the boat. You don't need to get rid of the old tether, it'll, it'll just snap anyway after a certain distance. So, just keep putting the new one down and reeling it in. if you watched my other video on trying to get this boat it was I didn't have very much success in getting it but this method you don't need a helicopter or anything just a grappling hook that is it 
so it doesn't matter how far you are in the game you know you should be able to get it pretty much almost any time obviously not if there's if the area is like hostile you you would um, you'd have to make it into a friendly province first otherwise you'd have uh, the bad guys shooting at you all the time when you're trying to, to move this Part. <laughs> like this is quite fun as well because you'd think by now that this this would be on fire and it would be all broken and everything but uh, it isn't and once you start getting downhill just jump in Stop moving, just use your grappling hook to pull you pull you down a bit more. And jump back in, in inside again. You're not gonna get thrown off the top of it then. surfboard <laughs> Back in quick. <laughs> now we're getting up, up some speed. And you would have thought by now it would be on fire and you'd be jumping out of it. But no, it's still going. Heading towards the coast, towards the water. Who needs a chainsaw to chop down trees when you've got a power boat? I've actually, I actually managed to get one of them big um, trucks as well, them big dumper trucks that uh, take up the whole road. What a palaver that was to get. Because you can't actually get it through some of the, um, the gateways, it's just too big. So I had to go a really long route across most of the map and take it to uh, one of my garages on the far right of the map. Took it from the top far left and then drove it to the bottom 
well not bottom far right but over to the right hand side yep still fine not on fire not smoking or anything What a tough boat this. There we are, we got it all the way to the water. So all we have to do now is uh, put a waypoint down and drive it to garage in the south of the island. I was only going to actually do one video of this game, but I think this is my third or fourth or something. But I'll, I'll put all these videos in my um, PlayStation Plus playlist. I'm not going. To, I won't start a separate play, playlist just for these games because there's not going to be a huge amount of videos of, the, of this game. And of course, once you get your vehicle back to your garage, um, if you've unlocked it, you get the, the nitro on it as well, which makes it even faster. I think I've got boat nitro 2. So it actually once you use it, it actually, the cooldown's a lot faster so you can use it more often. I'm actually driving it to uh, one of my settlements that, that's actually got a, um, a marina so I don't have to actually take it try and get it on land to to the garage part it's, itself like you have to do with the the land vehicles It's quite a fun way to do it. Just use your grappling hook to pull yourself towards the towards the sea, and then just drive it to your settlement. Would be interesting to see how far you would actually get on land if you did it all on land before it actually caught fire. I'd I wouldn't have thought you'd be able to get it all the way to your settlement, but it would be interesting, to, you know, to know. I just have to drive it into this little bit here. And there we have it. Vehicle chopped. And I can now use this vehicle. I can have it dropped from my um, my plane, so I can request it to be dropped anywhere in in the map that I want now. Many thanks for watching. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye for now.